A challenge at the top in the Republican Party in Texas. A former U.S. congressman wants to take over as the chair of the party. Tonight, CBS 19's Dana Huey sat down for an exclusive one-on-one -on -one to talk about the issues with Lieutenant Colonel Allen B. West. So when you look at the ideological battle for the soul of the United States of America, it's right here in Texas. Former Army and Lieutenant Colonel Allen West believes Texas new leadership is needed in the party that's facing a big challenge from Democrats in the state house. I just look at results and in November 2018 for the Texas Republican Party, we lost 12 state house seats. We lost two state senate seats. We lost two U.S. congressional seats. We lost 56 judgeships. West is going up against incumbent chairman James Dickey, who has led the state's Republican Party since 2017. Now before moving to Texas, West served as a representative from Florida in the U.S. House from 2011 to 2013. Prior to that, he served 22 years in the military. West believes his strong conservative values will resonate with Texans. We have to take our message, our strong message about our faith, our you know, families, uh, quality education, individual entrepreneurship, and small business development, and also service to the nation, and our energy sector. We need to make sure that everyone understands how important Texas is. West wants to be a strong voice in the conservative community. That includes gun rights amid recent church and mass shootings in Texas. If you go back and look at the shootings, it's not about the legal law-abiding citizen. It is about a person out there that is breaking the law. So if you make more laws, the law-abiding citizen is going to adhere to those laws. The criminal is not. The person that has a mental health issue is not. He's also passionate about reaching the black and Hispanic communities. A lot of people talk about, you know, we've got to do a better job in our urban centers and our suburban areas. I absolutely agree with that. You see the greatest amount of failure of the left's policies in our major population centers. So it's important that we take that message back into those areas, which are really, they're conservative in nature. In May, it's up to the Republican Party delegates to elect the next chair at the 2020 convention. We've got you covered, East Texas. Dana Huey, CBS 19.